welcome back to another episode of Pistoki Vlog. So for this episode, we're going to talk about how to groom your goldfish, uh, specifically on food and diet. So before anything else, uh, we need to understand first the nature of goldfish. Okay, now goldfish are omnivores. That means that they eat plant matters as well as animal matters. They are voracious eaters and that means that they eat a lot and I mean a lot of food. So in order for them to really grow into their full potential, uh, we need to groom them or feed them a lot so that uh, we can get results. Also, we groom our goldfish for two main reasons. Okay? One is to uh, make sure that we get uh, we get to see the full potential of our goldfish to you know to showcase or to even go into competitions, goldfish competitions. Second is of course for breeding, okay, for breeding purposes. So uh, we need to condition them to groom them uh, as best as we could so that we can get uh, good results when it comes to bleeding. Now when it comes to food and diet, uh, I feed my goldfish uh, different types of fish food. Now this fish food consists of uh, uh, high protein and vitamins as well as minerals so that uh, we can really get that uh, very good look in, the, in our goldfish. So the first thing we need to do is to uh, select what we feed our goldfish. Now for me, I choose uh, uh, dried pellets as well as steamed egg and also a mixture of uh, live food. Okay. Now how much do I feed my goldfish with these types of food? Now as for the pellets, I choose this uh, Hikari lion head. Now, so this is a very well known and uh, very well known uh, fish food in which it, uh, it promotes uh, wind growth. So basically, I focus on, uh, since I focus on Aranda goldfish, uh, I make sure that uh, my goldfish has this uh, good, you know, good form of their wind, their fins, their body. So for me, I use this lion head hickory for the staple food, okay? Now, how much do I feed them with this? Now, as you may have known from my other videos, I use a uh, food timer, right? So food timer helps me, allows me to consi consistently feed my goldfish uh, on an hourly basis. So for uh, this type of fish food, I feed them every hour from uh, 6 a.m. to 5 p.m. Okay, now that's like uh, 11 hours of feeding uh, with uh, uh, with dried pellets. As for the steam egg, I feed them uh, every two to three hours or so. So that's like uh, four to five times a day. And then in the evening, uh, by around 7 p.m., I feed them uh, live food such as to be flex, so that uh, they can consume it up until morning. Right? Now keep in mind that grooming goldfish is not an easy task. Okay, so uh, if you are not careful, your goldfish might get overfeed, and then uh, of course this will affect their growth as well as their form. You know, so there are unnecessary uh, for, uh, development of gold, goldfish if you uh, groom them in the wrong way. So, uh, goldfish grooming for me uh, requires a really tremendous effort when it comes to feeding them. Why? Because, of course, the food that they take is actually the, the one responsible for how they look in the end. So make sure, okay, to make sure that uh, you feed them properly. So another tip, another bonus tip when it comes to feeding, uh, you have to make sure that uh, your goldfish behavior is 
uh, you know, always finding that food. If they stay put, you know, if they stay put and doesn't really look for any food, uh, there's something wrong with your feeding because you're feeding too much, okay? We need to make sure that they only uh, consume what they can and what they need, okay? So that's why I put my timer on an hourly basis so that there's a gap, one hour gap for the fish to, to develop that appetite, okay? So the appetite is what we need to find there. So I only feed pellets. Uh, the amount of pellets I feed on my own fish is quite small on an early basis. Like they can consume it in, in one minute or so, so that uh, their appetite can develop. And while their appetite develops, of course, they will eat faster. They will eat a lot you know, in a single day. So that means that they can grow, you know, grow steadily rather than too fast or too slow okay one thing you need also to understand about goldfish is that they have this window of growth during its first year of growth uh, there's actually a boost in growth so they can reach their peak growth in one year so after one year their growth will slow down okay so there's actually a window there that we need to really grow our goldfish within the year so that's why we need to uh, feed them fast we need to uh, allow them to grow fast so that they can reach that peak uh, uh, growth i think that's it for this video and i hope you learned something from it and for those who haven't subscribed yet you can just click the subscribe button below so we can update you with our latest videos that's it happy fish keeping